Hello, Namaskara. Dr. Sushma Masood here, your neighborhood medical genie. I'm an intern at Wuhan University School of Medicine, China. Today's video is all about applying for health declaration form that is to be done right before you depart from India or your respective country, aka getting a green health code. So let's begin. In order to apply for green health code or health declaration form before travel, there's this website which I'll be linking down in the description box. So first you'll have to create an account in order to proceed further. I have already done that. I'm just going to log in. Slide to verify. Yeah. So first you'll have to check the Chinese embassy approved ICMR labs. Okay. You go here, go to your respective country. That's India for most of us. Okay, now here is the list. In case you want to search for your respective place, I am from Bangalore. So, Bangalore. Yeah, this is the list for Bengaluru. You can also verify this list with the ICMR labs. It's available online. Okay, I will be sharing this link as well down in the description box. You can just cross check it and then go ahead. Now, Let's look at the rules. This is in the visaforchina.cn. I will be linking this website as well down in the description box. Let's look at the rules. So you need a double nucleic acid test. That's RT-PCR test. One, 48 hours before the boarding. And the second one should be within 24 hours of boarding. So there are two things you need to keep in mind. One, it has to be ICMR and Chinese consulate approved labs. Second, your RT-PCR should be taken within 48 hours of your departure and within 24 hours of your departure. For example, let's say that your flight is at 10.20 a.m. on October 2nd. So your first RT-PCR that is within 48 hours should be done after 10.20 a.m. on 30th of September and not at or before 10 20 a.m make sure there's at least 5 to 10 minutes difference from the time of departure second rt pcr should be any time after 10 25 okay so it can be 10 30 or 10 40 that's all right but your second report should be made available as soon as possible because you will have to apply for green health code sometimes it takes five minutes sometimes it takes six to seven hours so you never know what's going to happen. Make sure you get the second report as soon as possible. Once you get your RT-PCR reports, you will have to apply for Green Health Code. You have to enter the same portal and you have apply for health declaration form. Apply for my health declaration and you just have to fill in. So I have done most of it. I'm just going to skim through name as per your passport, type of document, passport. Please fill in your passport number. Upload a picture of your passport photo page. This should be your front page of your passport which contains your photo and not the back page. Upload photos of Chinese visa. I uploaded two recent Chinese visas. One which I got recently, that's last month. Other is the one which I got in 2019. Nationality, others. Choose India or whichever country you belong to. Valid mobile phone number, please give your current phone number which is active. Gender, I'm female but you guys choose appropriately. Date of birth, please select your year, month and date. Okay, now flight itinerary details. Origin country where your journey starts, it's India. Uh, please put your flight number. Time of departure from the origin country, that is what time you're departing from India. My city of entry in China is Guangzhou, but you guys put whichever city you're ending up in. Now, your other information, COVID-19 nucleic acid test result. I tested negative and this is the lab I went for in Bangalore. This is the date when I got my first RT-PCR done. That was 48 hours before my departure. In this section, you will have to submit both 48 hours and 24 hours report. Uh, I'm yet to get my 24th hour report. So you guys upload it as soon as you get it. In this section, I will give you a list of things you're supposed to upload 
try to upload as many documents as possible in jpeg format first to being my ticket itinerary from india to colombo colombo to gongso so there i have two itineraries then my sri lankan visa hotel bookings two rt pcr labs i booked in sri lanka my vaccination certificate and the back page of my passport in order to prove my residence in india have you ever tested positive in a nucleic acid test no i haven't been but if you have please do mention if you ever been in close contact with confirmed covid-19 patient in past 5 days no i haven't been but if you have please do put in have you had any suspected symptoms of covid-19 i haven't had any but if you do have please do mention it now once you're done filling in this form all you have to do is submit and wait for your green health code so i forgot to mention an important aspect um that is i have flight transfer country if it's applicable since from india there are no direct flights all of you would end up in a transit country so please fill in the respective information as per your flight itinerary green health code varies from country to country it depends on which country you are transiting in my entire trip from india to gongso via colombo was taken care by an agency named pragati travels they have helped me out throughout the journey so i will be posting a video on my trip from india to gongso shortly so stay tuned before you transit in a particular country you will have to email the chinese embassy of that country ask them for specifications check out their website for rules and regulations for green health code and then only book your tickets four points i would like to reiterate firstly the labs and hospitals you would be choosing in order to submit your rt pcr samples should be chinese consulate recognized labs and hospitals coming to rt pcr test your first test should be done within 48 hours of your departure second test should be done within 24 hours of your departure and there should be a gap of at least 24 hours between your first and second rt pcr test third as soon as you get your second rt pcr test result please upload it as soon as possible because sometimes it varies from 5 minutes to 6 to 7 hours to get a green health code for example for me in bangalore it took me just 10 minutes to get my green health code whereas in colombo it took around 1 to 1 and a half hours after i submitted last but not the least if you don't upload clear documents with a clear qr code that is your documents are a bit blurry or you have uploaded wrong documents then you'll end up with a red code so double check it before you submit it i hope this video helped you guys please like share and subscribe leave your comments in the comment section below if you have any questions please feel free to ask me on instagram i've linked my insta id down below in the description box meanwhile stay happy stay tuned and dhanyawad kodu